Hello today's video we have the following content. On the night of Magnolia, Tang Yan, who was 40 years old, was a runner-up, but her emotional intelligence and reaction made the world take notice. Recently, the Magnolia Award has become the hottest topic in the entertainment industry. As the highest honor in the field of TV dramas, almost every actor is full of expectations and ambitions for this award. Even Joe Soon, who is in the limelight in the film industry, is eager to get the recognition and encouragement of this award. Among the actors and artists nominated this year, although some potential stocks unfortunately failed to be selected, the nominees are almost all powerful actors who are deeply loved by the audience. Mainly, the best supporting actor, has continued to produce high-quality works in recent years. From The Secret Corner to The Silent Truth, and then to last year's nomination for the Magnolia Best Supporting Actor for The Rival, these popular dramas with good reputations all show his outstanding performance. In the TV series Under the Bustling City, although Ning Li is a supporting role, he supports the highlights of the whole drama with his excellent acting skills. In contrast, the acting problems of the leading actors Bai Yufen and Xi Yong Hans here are more obvious. Although Zhang Yan herself is not a very popular actor, she won the love of many audiences this year with her outstanding performance in South to North, successfully attracted countless fans, and finally won the Best Supporting Actress. It is no exaggeration to say that Zhang Yan is definitely a dark horse in the Magnolia Awards. However, her works and outstanding acting skills really convinced the audience. The winner of the Best Actor who is also loved by the audience is Hu Jia. Among the Mesozoic actors, Hu Jia not only has high popularity and traffic, but also has a unique personality charm in The Flower released this year. In this legendary TV series, Hu Ji's acting skills can be called full marks. His performance is not only righteous, bold and brave, but also shows a strong ambition. Therefore, although Hu Jia defeated Fan Wei and won the Best Actor Award, netizens still gave him a high degree of recognition. In contrast, Jo Soon's winning of the TV Queen caused a lot of controversy. In the past two months, the discussion about Big as a Car overturning in public opinion has continued to heat up, and people have raised many questions about Jo Soon's understanding of the role in character creation. Objectively speaking, Jo Soon deserves the title of Best Actress. Her status in the mainland entertainment industry far exceeds that of many actresses. Not only has she made outstanding achievements in movies, but her performance in the nominated work The Imperfect Victim is also impeccable. What the audience regrets is not that Jo Soon won the award, but that there is only one Best Actress. In addition to Jo Soon, Yan Mi and Tang Yan have also created unforgettable characters in the past year, especially Tang Yan. As Tang Yan, who has always been at the bottom among the post-85s Hua Dan, her ambition in acting has almost disappeared over the years, causing fans to quit and causing commotion many times. However, who could have expected that a flower would make Tang Yan's popularity and reputation rise again? as if she had regained her youth. In the play, Tang Yan plays Miss Wong, who is innocent and enthusiastic. The ending that Miss Wong failed to get married with the Bao has also become a big regret for the audience of Flower. The reason why Miss Wong can stay deeply in the hearts of the audience is not only due to the clever plot setting and Wong Kar Wai's directing skills, but also the successful embodiment of Tang Yan's outstanding acting skills. Although Tang Yan was a runner-up at this award ceremony, the role she played impressed the audience. Although she is 40 years old, her emotional intelligence and reaction ability have amazed the world. When Jo Soon won the award, Tang Yan acted as if she had won the award herself. She smiled so hard that her eyes curved up and covered her face with her hands, unable to hide her surprise. From her expression and small movements, it can be seen that this joy is by no means a disguise, but she is really happy for her excellent colleagues. From her reaction, it can be seen that whether Jo Soon or any other nominees win the award, she will sincerely send her blessings. Although Tang Yan felt regretful and disappointed about not winning the award, she was more grateful. In the interview, Tang Yan always showed a generous demeanor. Facing the sharp questions of the reporter, she responded politely, expressed her gratitude to director Wang Karwai for giving her the opportunity, and said that she was very lucky to be able to participate in Flowers and play Miss Wang. At the end of her speech, Tang Yan waved her fist playfully and said with a smile, See you in the arena. He was frank and direct, modest and low-key, and at the same time confident and generous, fully demonstrating his pursuit and ambition as an actor. In this way, Tang Yan is completely different from the sweet image of the audience who gradually gave up some film and television work for life and children. 
in sharp contrast to some actors in the film and television industry who were embarrassed by missing awards, the 40-year-old Tang Yan showed a refreshing generosity and style. The competition for the 2021 Magnolia Award was equally fierce. At that time, the award-winning Tuan Yao was star-studded. Although Tan Song Gyan, Ni Ni, and Ri Aiza were also shortlisted, their reactions were flat. Except for applause from Ni Ni, the other two did not show any reaction either in front of the camera or behind the scenes. Especially Ri Aiza, who had the highest voice that year, although she frequently appeared on hot searches, she never released any updates about the Magnolia Award. Although the audience liked her role of Lee Shu Hua more, it has to be admitted that Ri Aiza's cold attitude of not responding is not pleasing. Even more outrageous is Yao Chen. In 2019, Yao Chen and Jiang Wenli competed for the Best Actress Award together, but ultimately failed to win the award. Afterwards, she posted a message lamenting, My luck in winning awards is as bad as ever. The so-called luck in winning awards is actually just a way for the audience to comfort those actors who have the ability but miss the award. Yao Chen called herself bad luck in winning awards, which actually implies that she thinks her acting skills are very good and she deserves to win the award, but her luck is not as good as other opponents, which seems a bit arrogant. Although Yao Chen does have enough confidence in film and television works and acting skills, at that time, Jiang Wenli, who had not yet starred in Corner Love, was also recognized as a powerful actor, so it was really unwarranted to be ridiculed like this. A similar situation has also occurred between Meitian and Sun Li. In 2014, despite the fact that Parents Love was nominated for almost all awards, Meitian still failed to win any award and eventually lost to Sun Li. In response, Meitian expressed her disappointment in her dynamic, It's really boring. I didn't win any award. I'm a little disappointed. It's indeed regrettable that she didn't win an award, but is it necessary to express it so directly on social platforms? The original intention of establishing the award is to encourage the achievements of actors, but it can't actually be used as a criterion for judging acting skills. If there are excellent works and roles, the audience will naturally remember them. Although Fan Wei failed to participate in the Magnolia Award this time, in the hearts of many audiences, he has long been the best actor. In the face of such an award, showing a black face or dissatisfaction is somewhat lacking in grace. In short, the performance of the young Tang Yan at the Magnolia Award ceremony did let the audience see her open-minded and relaxed side. Such an actress with high emotional intelligence and broad vision will surely continue to surprise the audience in future creations. Next news. On the night of the Magnolia Awards, Tang Yan, who was 40 years old and running as a companion, showed everyone the reality of domestic entertainment. The Magnolia Award is a hot topic in the entertainment industry recently. As the highest honor in the field of TV dramas, almost all actors are full of expectations and ambitions for it. Even Joe Soon, who is in the limelight in the film industry, is eager to get the recognition and encouragement of this award. Judging from the actors nominated this year, although there are potential stocks that have been omitted, the nominees are almost all powerful actors who are deeply loved by the audience. In recent years, mainly, the best supporting actor, has continued to show outstanding performances. From The Secret Corner to The Silent Truth, and then to last year's nomination for the Magnolia Award for Best Supporting Actor with The Rival, every drama he has participated in has gained extremely high reputation and widespread attention. In the TV series Under the Bustling City, although Ning Li is only a supporting role, he has supported the highlight of the whole drama with his excellent acting skills. In comparison, the acting flaws of the leading actors Bai Yufen and Xi Yong Hans here are more obvious. Regarding the winner of the Best Supporting Actress Award, Jiang Yan, although she has never been a particularly famous actor, this year she has won the love of many fans with her outstanding performance in South to North. It is no exaggeration to say that Jiang Yan is undoubtedly a dark horse in the Magnolia Awards, but her works and acting skills have really convinced the audience. Also widely praised by the audience is Hu Jia, who won the Best Actor Award. As a Mesozoic actor, Hu Jia not only has high popularity and wide attention, but this year he played a Bay O in Flower and not only showed his external charm, but also his deep personal charm. In this legendary TV series, Hu Ji's performance is perfect. He is both righteous and bold, brave and ambitious. Therefore, although Hu Jia defeated Fan Wei and won the honor of Best Actor, netizens still highly recognized his performance. In contrast, Jo Soon's winning of the TV Queen has caused widespread controversy. In the past two months, the public opinion of Big as a Car overturning has continued to ferment, 
and many people have questioned her understanding of the role and the characterization of the character. However, from an objective point of view, Jo Soon deserves the title of Best Actress. Her status in the domestic entertainment industry is far higher than other actresses. Whether it is her film achievements or her performance in the nominated work Imperfect Victims, it is impeccable. The audience is not disappointed that Jo Soon won the award, but that there is only one Best Actress. In addition to Jo Soon, Yan Yi and Tang Yan have also created unforgettable characters for the audience in the past year, especially Tang Yan. As Tang Yan, who has always been at the bottom of the 85 flowers, her enthusiasm for her acting career has almost disappeared in recent years, and she has even experienced the storm of fans leaving her fans many times. However, who would have expected that a flower would instantly revitalize her popularity and reputation? In the play, Miss Wong, played by her, is innocent and enthusiastic. Although Miss Wong did not end up with a bayo, this ending became a big regret for the audience of Flower. The reason why Miss Wong is deeply in the hearts of the audience is not only because of the regrettable arrangement of the plot, nor is it just because of Wong Kar Wai's directing skills, but also because of the excellent performance of actress Tang Yan. Although Tang Yan was already 40 years old and did not win an award at this award ceremony, her emotional intelligence and witty reactions have won the admiration of audiences around the world. The role she played was even more refreshing to the audience. Tang Yan's reaction to Jo Soon's award was as if she had won the award herself. She smiled so hard that her eyes narrowed into a line and covered her face with her hands, unable to hide her inner surprise. It is obvious that Tang Yan's joy was not fake, but she was really happy for this outstanding colleague. From her reaction, it is not difficult to see that she would sincerely wish Jo Soon and other nominees a win. Tang Yan felt both regret and loss for not winning the award, but more of gratitude. In the interview, Tang Yan always showed extraordinary demeanor. Facing some sharp questions from reporters, she always remained polite and expressed her deep gratitude for the opportunity given by director Wang Karwai. She was very fortunate to have met Flowers and the role of Miss Wang. At the end of her speech, Tang Yan playfully waved her fist and said with a smile, See you in the arena. He is frank and direct, humble and low-key, confident and generous, and never forgets to show his pursuit and ambition as an actor. Today's Tang Yan is completely different from the sweet image in the audience's memory that gradually reduced her film and television work for life and children. Compared with the embarrassment and displeasure of some actors in the film and television industry when they missed the award, the 40-year-old Tang Yan showed a refreshing pattern. The competition for the 2021 Magnolia Award is still fierce, and Tong Yao, who finally won the award, is even more radiant. Tan Song Gyan, Nini and Ri Aiza, who were also nominated, were relatively calm. Nini applauded and congratulated on the spot, while the other two did not react significantly either in front of the camera or behind the scenes. In particular, Ri Aiza, who had the highest voice that year, frequently appeared on hot searches, but never released any updates about the Magnolia Award. Although the audience prefers her role as Li Shuhua, it has to be admitted that Ri Aiza's indifferent attitude of not responding is not pleasing. The most surprising thing is Yao Chen. In 2019, she competed with Jiang Wenli for the Best Actress Award, but ultimately failed to win. As a result, she posted on social media that my luck in winning awards is as bad as ever. The saying of winning awards has always been a phrase used by audiences to comfort actors who have the ability but fail to win awards. Yao Chen's self-proclaimed luck in winning awards undoubtedly implies her confidence in her acting skills and that she deserves to win awards, but she is just not as lucky as others. Although Yao Chen does have a strong foundation in film and television works and acting skills, Jiang Wenli, who did not star in Corner Love, was also recognized as a powerful actress that year, and it is indeed somewhat innocent to be satirized in this way. Similar situations have also occurred to Mei Tan and Sun Li. In 2014, although Parents Love was nominated for almost all awards, Mei Ting still lost to Sun Li, and the actors still won nothing. In response, Mei Ting said in her dynamics, it's really boring, I didn't win any. I'm a little disappointed, dot. It is normal to feel regret for not winning an award, but is it necessary to express it so bluntly on social platforms? The original intention of establishing the award is to encourage the achievements of actors, but it cannot really measure the level of acting skills. As long as there are excellent works and outstanding roles, the audience will naturally remember them. Although Fan Wei did not attend the Magnolia Award ceremony this time, he is still the best actor in the hearts of many audiences. To treat such an award, the blackface and dissatisfaction seem a bit lacking in grace.
In summary, the performance of the young Tang Yan at the Magnolia Award ceremony did show her open-minded and calm side. This actress with high emotional intelligence and big pattern will surely continue to surprise the audience in future creations. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel, 